Hey, it's Nate from Navigator Bookkeeping here with the last video in the business structures series. So we've gone over a lot of different types of businesses, sole proprietorships, partnerships, C-Corps, S-Corps, um, LLCs, PCs, and any other ones that I forgot, but I think those are most of the ones that we covered. But the question now is which one's right for you? Well, obviously go back and watch the videos to learn more specifically about each of those and, and do your research online too. There's a lot of really good resources comparing the different types of businesses. But what it comes down to for me is two pieces. Number one, how is it going to change your tax situation? Different business types are really going to change how you pay yourself, how you pay your taxes, whether uh, everything flows through to your personal tax return, whether it's completely separate from you, corporate and personal. So that's the first part to think about is how is it going to change how you pay yourself, how your taxes are paid, and the different advantages and disadvantages of that. There can be pretty big swings there, thousands of dollars potentially in how much you're paying in taxes. So that's a really important part to think about. Secondly, what about the complexity of the organization? Certain organizations are gonna be a lot more uh, to get started, both in time, money, and effort, and also ongoing um, maintenance, whether it's having to record minutes, having to record certain meetings, having to have certain people as officers in the business. And other types of businesses are going to be really simple. Pretty much you're going to pay a fee or even in the case of some not pay a fee and you're going to have the structure set up. So that's the second part to think about. How much time do you want to put in? How much complexity um, do you want to have to worry about with your business structure? Um, so those are the main two pieces to think about. If you can kind of find the sweet spot between those two, that's probably a good choice for you. But once again, go back and watch the videos again. Check out which ones make sense for you. And if you're still curious, I'd definitely love to answer any questions that you have but you can also find a lot of good resources online for that as well. So hopefully this, hopefully this uh, video series has been really helpful to you, and hopefully you can find the best business structure for yourself. Thanks.